your voice wasn't like that yeah what happened it just got more powerful more powerful yes so i have to control it so bad because i'm a i'm a bus your speakers or something i did a lot of crusades eh, in uh -huh. villages that's uh -huh. why they call me pastor uh-huh i'm not a pastor i haven't been to bible school and okay. i have to release i i control the voice so much can you hear me clearly yeah yeah, if I go, it will go higher and higher and higher. I'll bust all your, bust your speakers. Oh yeah, yeah. You know, I I do this in villages without mics. Talk about ten thousand people in Uganda, Sierra Leone, like without Nigeria. microphones. Huh? Without, without microphones. microphones, yeah. Yeah, you know. And then, um, can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. So usually, when I'm talking in mics in radio stations, I. I, 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 it's called a, it's called a falsetto. Do you know falsetto? What's that? This is the voice. This is a falsetto. Oh, falsetto okay. is it's like a false voice. Oh, okay. It's called a falsetto. It's a music music word. Oh, okay. I'm not a musician though. Please, I hope you are enjoying the content. And please, if today is your first time here, kindly hit on the subscribe button, like the video, and drop me some comments as you watch this video. My name is Mr. Showbiz. Let's continue to enjoy the content. Uh, uh, okay. uh, yeah, so I usually use a uh, falsetto just to calm it down. Instead of go JJ Rowling style, <laughs> Yvonne oh. Nelson. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> and to, uh, voice as you see, do you think you're riding a diamond? You know, when you are close to God, uh -huh. you know, that's why I tell people, you know, when you are close to God and things happen, uh -huh. listen, all the pastors out there, will you please stop telling the congregation your troubles are over? Hey. Yeah. And that is when you hear the church scream the loudest. What is wrong with you? Yeah. You see, when you are very close to God, anything you're going through you just remind yourself who is with you in that situation mm -hmm. okay the devil has no power over us mm -hmm. the devil only have power over you if you open up and let him that is it that's it he doesn't have any part to do nothing to you mm. you're prayerful you you have a prayer life you have a fasting life you have a relationship with god you mm. don't have a problem mm. you don't have a problem all right mm -hmm pastors again out there stop telling the congregation your troubles are over jesus said in this world you shall have troubles but be of good cheer i have what overcome the world I, god almighty said i will be with you in trouble i will deliver you and honor you with long life will i satisfy you and show you my salvation the only time you don't have trouble is when you are dead the only time troubles stop is when you die so it means we were born with it and and it depends on how you want to call it and how they make us see it you see the obstacle if you have a pen and paper write this down the obstacle the obstacle mm. is the way the up what you call the trouble is the way that is the way mm. and don't see that trouble it's part of the the plan is part of the process it's part of the building up it's part of sculpture <laughs> the says your troubles are over the now from where, where they all lying the only way your troubles will be over is the day you die why are you running away from trouble you need to stand with it then sort it you out need to you need to know who mm. is in it with you mm. wake up every morning and at the front part of your brain remember mm. know mm. who is with you god mm. is with me god mm. is with me god is with me mm. at the front side of your head always put god first, first. in your head in mm. your mind in your mind in your mind mm. know who is with you you are knowing this alone you're not waking up alone you're mm. walking with god you're mm. with him you're with him you're mm. with him mm. that is the way you start having a relationship know him at the front side of your head the, the, trouble comes know who you are with in the trouble wow. and you walk through it and look Yvonne is telling Yvonne went through some serious thing when we shot her first movie mm -hmm. they stole the movie was stolen when it happened 
it was a disaster we were all devastated Yvonne is telling the story a few days ago and she's, she, she's laughing would she have laughed at the time it happened mm -hmm. we thought this is over man somebody's money it wasn't our money mm -hmm. it was someone's money they stole the movie that we used the money to produce it's gone that was trouble we were in mm -hmm. the guy could have jailed us mm -hmm. you are lying i don't believe you you probably didn't shoot a movie you say you lied to me why let's go to court but if one stood up there sorted out something else mm. you know but Yvonne also has a relationship with god yeah she knows who she's with you know and then you come you you come out of it stop telling the congregation uh, uh, your troubles are over troubles never end I was your mother dear Maji de Kano. Was it a soft one? I'm sorry, I must say your troubles are over. No, we are push you for. I didn't say that. I don't can say. I just stop telling the congregation that. Oh no, they are no, they are misleading. They are misleading the church. Your troubles can be over. Your troubles are only over here. Yeah, yeah. I didn't stop telling them that. <laughs> but sir, uh, stop telling them that. You know, it means they are uh, uh, drunk. Ah, yeah. uh, and I'm a boy one. Kind of. Ah, I'm a Christian. Who is running to one day? Okay. Maybe because we need, oh, we need, we need the work, can we? But oh, how I get them a boy. Asora. Eh. Benny Madi couldn't go for go and go for the work, Asora. Debbie. Because what pede a sophonic can that what pede what's in it, what's it? Uh huh. So it calms them down and you know, but Snyami saw the BBR, my no. We mm. have the Bible, mm. but we don't read it. But we go and sit in church and want a pastor to read it to us. Mm. Yeah, in Tinoya, sometimes you're born pay or a day you're born pay, and you're me too. Holy Spirit, no too much treachery, word, nasty train. Because you're mm -hmm. not dumb, I'm not dumb. Mm -hmm. You read that. The same way a pastor no onya in church no. Also, every two man, every two matter see them. So that be Majid Michel. He be one of the big actors in Ghana here we get for one industry inside. He has been featured in many movies and now he's a pastor. And you hear him out. I, I I was shocked when I heard his voice for the first time on UTV when he was speaking, and I was like, ah, Majid Michel, this guy with movies. Girls, what they love him, then things. Look at how he did, he did speak right now. What what happened to his voice? So this is from him. How he lost his voice. He preaches to people, a whole lot of congregation, without using the microphone. And this is surely going to have effect on his voice. But thank God, say he's able to control it. Whilst we're watching, you notice he said he has two voices. That's a subset of on the main voice. You get me? So if he choose the one uh, to use when speaking and i think this is this is a plus you get me this is a plus but you know charlie just be the god's work way man they do that why it result that and if they do god's work to actually blessings all you get be so it did my name is mr showbiz kindly drop your suggestions in the comment section like the video i go drop you more entertainment content here and i'm out